Hello guys, my name is Fox, and welcome to part 11 of our Crusader Reckonings 2 Game of Thrones mod, where we playing as the Daenerys Targaryen. Let's continue. So, in the previous episode we finished our war for liberation of some place. I already don't remember how it were called, but um, for some reason it all became fractured because of some uh, something with the daughter key planes. So it was like part of it became independent, some of it still uh, the some of it still controlled by me, so yeah. Now I'm trying to liberate Zeko uh, to take an, uh, to get enough lands to be able to create the Kingdom of Sarnor. So that's our goal for now. High Septon has died and got succeeded by someone. Okay. I don't care really much about this. Also looks like this guy called in some people into his war. He was actually a decent amount of armies. I should do something with this. We could usurp High Lordship of Yunkai. My sweet... <laughs> my sweet Edric has acknowledged the bastard child he had with some slut. Oh. That's unfortunate. Oh, really? I hope he's not actually gonna be... No, it's just Sarah. I hope she's not gonna become your successor. I would be really upset. Uh, also, I could now usurp High Lordship of Yunkai. From this guy, which gonna help me with delivering all of these kingdoms, which I'm gonna do. Let's go and usurp it. And then we'll see what's gonna we do, uh, what we're gonna do next. Maybe I could like uh, give away Astapor now and it's gonna look a little bit better than last time. Also, my, my allies just lost a pretty huge battle in here. Let's go and try to help them by fighting some armies. Actually, they're gonna be gone a lot sooner than me. Actually, no. July, it's June. Okay. Also, winter is coming, apparently. Lost some siege of the trade post. But yeah, our dragon tactics should help quite a lot. Quite a lot. Let's go and destroy the other army as well. Why are we losing the sieges? I actually don't know. Because this guy helping me siege, I'm just gonna participate in battles. And I think should be able to win them. Mostly thanks to the dragon. No man's lands get mild winter. Oh, no man's lands, it's in here, right? Right. Okay. Fine with me. Our middle flank are losing again. But we are fine. Could we raise any more troops of our own? We could. Let's not take this once. But this 7k stack should definitely be useful. Because our army is actually getting a little bit too thin. Even though we have dragons and stuff, but... Oh, actually, this war is already won. Okay, let's just go and force the mans. Let's get this and... Oh, okay, you could be stood down. Now, we could create Kingdom of Saria and Kingdom of Sarnor. What is Saria? And where is that? It's in here. Okay, I'm fine with that. But first of all, I'm gonna create Sarnor. And... Actually, I could probably give it away to you, right? Where's the ruler in here? So, grand title, Kingdom of Sarnor, including lower titles. Yeah, you should be actually happy about this, right? Yeah, you have all the du jour stuff. That's great. I still legally own slaves. Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna free them all. Is this land gonna be mine? No. The Turkey Sea, blah blah blah, so some stuff just became independent again. But we still have this lands. And we still could create the Kingdom of Essaria. Which I am going to do. Actually, this guy now lands, uh, owns land in here. Which technically is a part of Volantis. Mm. 
<laughs> oh, it's this guy. Who we've been at war with, right? Yeah. Okay, so we have this in here. Oh, we're also still technically at war, but it's about to finish. What should I do with Asaria? Because I don't want this lands to be as a part of Asaria. And now let's wait on this. And here we have the Dotra key. I don't know how the hell I got this title because I, I wasn't, I haven't created it, so I don't know. Also, it would be great if this guy declared a war on Haro and tried to take some of his uh, de jure lands. Would be useful. And yeah, it would be also useful if we finished this war, so I could start managing my other kingdom titles. Okay, some de jure claims. We could get another Septon, but unfortunately there's none available. It's still saying that there's no heir to my dynasty. Could I get any concubines? No. Could I try to seduce someone? Actually, I should not be doing this, because my husband is the king of the Iron Throne, so I should have children with him, not with someone else. Okay, the wars ended. You're now the part of my kingdom again. And some other lands get in winter, okay. But, what about Astapor now? It is... Or this guy. He has the High Lordship of Astapor. And he's sitting in some lands of the Yunkai, which I don't like. Okay, you. You could actually easily get the kingdom of Astapor, I think. Actually, why can't I give it away again? I can't give it to you, but not to this guy. That's strange. Mm, I don't want to give away this one. Because it's a part of Yunkai, actually. Yeah, Lordship of Cauldron. Not supposed to be yours. Could I actually revoke it? Um, no. Mm. Oh well, I'll just give it away. It's gonna be easier this way. So, Kingdom of Astapor is now yours. And this guy is supposed to be your vassal, so I'm gonna transfer it. Yeah, this one. And this one is a part of Yunkai. Because it's fine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, he have one hole uh, he's not supposed to have. But it's not too much of a problem. Also, do you want to get a... Money? 11? No, that's actually not enough. And you want to join the war again. I guess I'm going to accept. Is my vassals gonna answer any calls? Are they uh, not supposed to? Probably not. Okay, you moved your capital. Why not to the Astapor itself? And no. Doesn't matter really. Okay, now we have tons of kingdoms. Also, Kingdom of Isaria. What am I gonna do with you? Uh, okay, never mind. I can't create it anymore. Because apparently tons of it became independent again. Also this guy is supposed to be the vassal of Sarnor, at least part of you. So let's go and transfer vassalage of this guy. And this one could be mine for now. Empress Daenerys and Daela become close friends. Is it my older daughter? No, it's the younger one. Okay. So, wars, wars, wars. Who are you at war with? Attacking uh, someone in migration somewhere. Okay. 
and defend them against this place. Fine with me as well. How's our older daughter looking? She's 14. She's pretty decent at traits. She's not considered as my heir still. Could I kill this guy yet? Maybe any any new bright uh, bribes available? Unfortunately, not. Hmm. And I can't get a son for some stupid reason. Empress Daenerys has inherited city of Mirin Harbor from Mirin Harbor. Okay. So this one. Wrong type of holding. Why city of Mirin is not wrong type of holding, but city of Mirin Harbor is. Actually, I have a lot more demand size. Which I should be using. But I guess we're just gonna create a random vassal in here. If it's considered as a wrong holding. Could I like revoke some stuff in here? Probably not really. Or could I plot? Oh yeah, I could plot to revoke. Some stuff, plot to kidnap tons of people. High lordship, lordship. Actually, that's not the stuff I'm looking for. Revoke some stuff from Vyas Dotrak, why would I want it? Who's the guy you? Okay, with this, <laughs> with this uh, Dotrak, I think, it's really strange how it's working. I don't understand, but at least we have some vassals in here with kingdom titles, so maybe they're gonna be expanding. Yeah, who knows? Who knows? I just need to look at this tab. Oh! Why all the sudden Kingdom of New Geese hates me? Usurp titles, foreign conqueror. No! You're not supposed to have these things. I gave these titles to your father. And he's been liking me. Hmm. God damn it. You're now not gonna join any of my wars, right? And they can't really bribe you or anything. Can't really convert you. Hmm, that's unfortunate. Oh well. Maybe you're gonna change your mind at some point. My courtier has a pressed desire to get married. Okay, you could get it, I guess. Like this one. Sounds great. So, what's about the Iron Throne? What should we do with that? Also, you, charitable or just, zealous or greedy. This one's gonna be better. Uh, also, why is the heck part of Volantis is independent? Actually, why is it so. What's happening here? Why is it so shattered? I don't know. So, how much troops do we have now? We have 14 k from here, 27 from our allies. And... We have a... We have an embargo on you. What about the bigger guy? We have an embargo on you as well. Where is our liberation gone? What about the lease? We could liberate the lease. I wouldn't be against it. How much troops do you have? We have not much. Okay, let's try it. Probably could get tons of... Oh, never mind, I can't press it. I could only have an emancipation on you. God damn it. What about this Volantis? Why do you have so much different Volantis around here? All of this stuff could be only colonized. Actually, we don't have enough money to start colonization, so maybe we should do should colonize Borash. Actually, I wanted to colonize Vice Orvik, so then I'm gonna have an access to Quartz. So, let's go and do this. Colonization of Vice Orvik. What should I do? Do I need to get my army in here? Probably. Let's go. And... 100% Warscar 
with someone's war for independence. Okay, good job Iron Throne. It would be also a lot better if you actually made a sun for me. Why is the rich still staying in here? They are attacking Stormlands in some claim. Okay. Something changing here. Zekko is now there. <laughs> oh yeah. It's all changing. All the time. Under my guidance, my young daughter is slowly mastering the art of swordsmanship. Oh, she became a trained fighter. Great. So. Yeah, it's probably gonna get just instantly sieged. And it should be 100% war score, right? Uh, oh, I'm ill. And why can't I siege it? How is this working? Colony will be established in Vice Orvik. The warrant is the colony will be blah blah blah. Yeah, I know. But how could I siege it? It's only showing 51. Okay, now it's sieging. That's strange. And this thing is surrendering. Okay. We get the colonization. You have a decree that new colony shall be established in the name of House Targaryen. All this needed is the final order. So, lose gold. Let's get the colony. Level size supply limit for level garrison size. Mm, yeah, I'm fine with it. Uh, Elgant Hallow, the wife of my lover Barry's son. Shocked me by asking me to face if you're having an affair. I will kill the bitch. Uh, no. I'm just gonna deny. Is he really my lover? Why is not showing in my lovers? Actually it is showing. Okay. Great. So, now I have a colony in here. For how long is the colony gonna stay? I don't know. Should I keep this province for myself? Technically the part of Quart. Actually I could definitely take uh, the capital of Quart for myself. It's probably gonna be really rich. And considering the my demand size, these things definitely need to have random vassals created. But the capital of Quart shouldn't be a terrible idea to take. Actually, do we now have a... Liberation on you? We do, because we are born in you. Great. How much troops do you have? We have 26,000. Oh, that's actually a little bit too much. Only have 16 currently. Anything we could do with this? We could spend some money on something. Tax, income, light infantry. Maybe something for some more income. Yeah, private farms. It is, why not? And we're losing some people from our prison. Can we actually ransom anyone? Not really. Let's go stop all the plots. Or all the possible ones, at least. Oh, today at court your hunting dog suddenly started raging. Tore loose and attacked one of your courtiers. Heal, 50% chance. Malfia, 30% chance. Princess. Oh, so my daughter. Could get wounded, 20% chance she die, oh. My god, that's definitely because I'm lunatic. Okay, let's see. Oh my fucking god! My best daughter just died to an accident, really? Look at her, she oh my god, she was so good. And 20% chance and of course she died. And now your dog is dead. <laughs> A pyramid for faithful. <laughs> 200 gold. And we could hunt the dog will be removed from us. Yeah. We could bury our dog in the pyramid. Uh, no thanks. I'm just gonna bury him quietly because he just killed my daughter. Great. My god, such a great character. It's not fair. This one is not that great. She don't even have strong trait. Great Harlot of Assyria. Not interesting. 
What about the Kingdom of Assyria? And we have control of 45%. Okay, it's not enough. Also, oh, Haro, what are you doing? Defending against this guy. Okay. Uh, and actually, it is already time for me to have a break, guys. So, oh, what's happening in here? Defending against revolt. Okay. So, in the next episode, I think uh, we should be able to declare war on Quarth if you're gonna get enough troops replenished. So, yeah. If you enjoyed watching this, you could leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And if you want to leave a comment, you should definitely do it. And I would answer you as soon as I could. See you later, guys. Bye bye.